Hi, I'm Managing Editor Dan Day, and here are some of the top stories in Friday's Modesto B. A funeral was held in Modesto Thursday for Marine Lance Corporal Aaron Simons, who was killed in combat in Iraq last month. Our Brian Ramsey was there and files this report. Another local Marine has fallen in the war in Iraq. Marine Lance Corporal Aaron Simons was a friend to all who knew him, a dedicated soldier, and a devoted family member. Aaron Simons was laid to rest Thursday at Lakewood Memorial Park in Houston after a morning service at Calvary Temple in Modesto. Family has been grieving normally, but they are a remarkably resilient group and uh, they really do attest their resiliency to their faith and the support, the incredible support that they've received in the community. It's really been a remarkable thing to watch. Lance Corporal Simons left his mark on his fellow Marines. I served with Aaron for a little over a year. Uh, I deployed with him on the last deployment back in August of, of 2004. Um, he was an outstanding Marine. Uh, he was, I was his squad leader, so I was in charge of him, and it is, he was a phenomenal, phenomenal Marine. And I, he will deeply be missed by the Marines of Suicide Charlie, 1-7. He taught everybody pretty much in our company how to play the guitar. I mean, he taught me how to play a chord, and it's only the G, and ever since then, I said, I've been practicing on that. That's the only thing I know how to do on a guitar. So, I mean, he, he, he taught everybody. He, he, took, he put his time out for everybody else that, that needed help. Along with a large turnout showing their support, Booney Long's father, who lost his son in Iraq in March, expressed his condolences to the family. To express on their behalf uh, their very deep felt appreciation to the community, um, the way that they have been supported and rallied to has been an overwhelming thing for them and they, uh, they are very, very appreciative of that. The United States of America, to all who shall see these presents greeting, this is to certify that the President of the United States of America has awarded the Purple Heart, established by General George Washington at Newburgh, New York, August 7, 1782. Two, Lance Corporal Aaron W. Simons, United States Marine Corps, for wounds received in action on 24 April 2006 in Iraq, resulting in his death, given under my hand in the city of Washington, is 25th day of April 2006. J.F. Settler, Lieutenant General, United States Marine Corps, Commander, U.S. Marine Forces Central Command. For a rundown on national and international news, here's Ed Wilhide. Thanks, Dan. Anyone who's ever taken preschoolers to the doctor knows they often cry more before the shot than afterward. Now researchers say that for some people, anticipating pain truly is as bad as actually experiencing it. In Sacramento, the California Assembly has voted to restrict the use of ultrasound machines for personal use, approving a bill that would allow them to be sold only to licensed professionals. Democratic Assemblyman Ted Lieu introduced the bill after film star Tom Cruise bought an ultrasound machine to see images of his unborn child. Be sure to check today's B Sports section for a story about the changing nature of the Modesto Relays logo. We'll have coverage of the relays on ModB.com and in the B throughout the weekend. For all the day's top stories, turn to the Modesto B or keep it right here at ModB.com.